You know, we have a 147th premiere, European and worldwide premiere. We are very proud of that. It's uh, in Geneva, you know, most of the time we have a lot of premiere because it's uh, one of the first important show in the year. And Geneva is a neutral, in a neutral country. We have no, uh, no, no brand, no Swiss brand. That's why we have a lot of uh, European and worldwide premiere. A lot of our visitors, they go and see and they go to the motor show to dream. And they see some incredible car like the McLaren, the Ferrari, as you were saying. It's fantastic. It's also a place for dreaming, the Geneva Motor Show. Not only for choosing a car, but uh, it's well known in Geneva that we have a, a lot of range of different cars. Luxus, practical, uh, electric, hydrogen cars. And that's very important to have a, a full range of cars. As you were saying, markets in Europe and the United States are, are doing pretty well. And we expect that in, in this year the market will be the same. So I see one problem is the judicial problem and who will be responsible for such a car. And that has not been solved so far, you know. Uh, let's suppose that you are in an autonomous car, you have an accident. Who is responsible? Are you responsible even though you are not driving? Or is the automaker responsible? That's a big question which is not solved now. Therefore, it, it, in order to summarize your, your question, I think that we, we talk a lot about autonomous car as we were talking a lot about electric car, but it will take a long time before it is a, a, a car we see every day on the street in Geneva.